so here's literally everything that you need to know about solo leveling arise and the first thing being its actual release date as we are right here on the official solo leveling arise website from that marble themselves and so this tells us that the game will be coming out in spring 2024 being this year of course now this means the game will probably come around out around april uh, march april may time obviously probably not in march because it we're already almost like halfway through march so we still got a very long time to go uh, until the game is probably going to come out and then also you got to keep in mind that dates like these can always change because originally this game was meant to come out last year around winter time i believe but it was then delayed up until spring 2024 for what i feel like should be an obvious reasoning to do with the actual anime coming out so i feel like they wanted to actually release the game after the anime had has hit its like massive peak especially once it gets to the end of the first part of uh, the first season so just keep in mind that these things could change and delays could happen because anything can happen at any time but i do actually also have some more actual specific information on when the specific release date for this game is actually going to come out as we've had some korean articles show where a specific a potential specific release date of the game is going to actually happen as this article says right here as you can see in this paragraph right here it says regarding the specific release date of the new game only i level up is scheduled to be released in april after conducting an open beta test in march now we are of course already in march so hopefully relatively soon we should have an open beta test that may last like one to like, like hopefully around like two weeks or so so if it's going to get announced it's going to have to get announced very very soon and then something else that will also back up this information even more is that netmarble themselves have said that the new action rpg only i love level up arise or solo leveling arise as this is just a rough translation from uh korean to english it says it will hold a showcase on the 19th of march which is in around six days time which is going to be amazing and it will be uh i don't know if it'll be live streamed or anything i think it will just be straight up uploaded to the netmarble youtube channel and then this specific i guess also article or like news thing from netmarble also says that the netmarble ceo has announced that it will hold a showcase for the action rpg only i level up arise and then it says it is also being developed to release in the first half of the year as we know it potentially should be releasing in springtime and it will happen at 10 a.m on the on tuesday march 19th which should be really really good and then it also says in this showcase specific game introduction and business scheduling for several so sort of leveling arise will also be announced now this can mean many different things as obviously this is once again a rough a rough translation so th this could mean a whole bunch of different things like the, the whole business scheduling of of this game could mean that we actually get a release date we could get open beta dates and stuff like that so that could be really really cool hopefully but also none of these things could also happen and it could just be what like it says just a showcase for the game to show it off and um, hopefully give us some more info on, on what the actual game is about and what we can actually do within the game apart from just killing a bunch of monsters non-stop pretty much which then brings us back to the korean article where again it, sh it should be scheduled to release in april which again hopefully we could potentially see within this new showcase or whatever so fingers crossed we're going to hopefully get release dates maybe open beta news and stuff like that just anything that will just give hype to the game will just be great and that will excite me a lot so then of course as we already know from a bunch of different trailers and stuff and, and gameplay like snippets that we've actually seen is that we're actually going to be able to play as all the, all the different characters from solo leveling but what has also actually also been recently shown is that from the official solo leveling arise uh, twitter page is that we're actually also going to be getting original characters as they tweeted relatively recently i believe yeah like two days ago that solo leveling arise is going to have an original character reveal and then basically whenever this tweet reaches a certain amount of likes and retweets which it already has so hopefully we should get it relatively soon then we'll be able to see who this original character actually is which i think is pretty cool i i do like original characters to a certain extent it's just if if it, the the sole focus of the game becomes around these original characters then i feel like it could just get very annoying and boring because we don't want it to take away from actual solo leveling but i think additions like these can be very positive but also can have a lot of negatives and stuff like that if it's done wrong but i mean we're just gonna have to hope and trust in that in that marble that they're gonna get it right and hopefully they do so then the very final thing i want to talk about is going to be the actual features within the game as of course we're going to have a load of great action within the game some nice story cutscenes and stuff and a load of different new abilities weapons and stuff for us to use to customize our character on jim Wu, to be able to absolutely pop off with it within game but then we also do have other things within the game but what which says right here that we're able to join forces with other hunters now i feel like some people might see this as a confirmation for, for multiplayer within this game however i don't think that's the case i'm pretty sure this game is a single player just just strictly single player game which is unfortunate but hopefully in the future they can add multiplayer maybe hopefully that'll be really really good but i think if it would ever happen it would happen in a very very long time after the game's actual full release so yeah that's a bit of a shame but it, again i'm not too bothered too much as long as the game itself is just really really good i won't mind and then the most interesting part about all the features that they have actually shown us through this website is going to be that the ability to form our own army of shadows 
shadows. So of course, as if you've read the manhwa, you would know that Jinwu is able to extract the shadows of enemies that he defeats and can make them uh, his own shadow soldiers to be able to use to fight alongside him. And it seems like we're going to be able to do that in game as well, which is going to be fantastic. So hopefully when it comes to actually a lot of like the main story stuff or whatever, when we beat a bunch of the main story bosses, hopefully we can be able to extract their shadows and be able to use them within the actual gameplay to have them fight alongside us as well, which hopefully will be amazing. But also within Solar Leveling Rise, we know we're also going to get original monsters, which is also going to be very, very good. And hopefully we'll be able to extract their shadows as well to give us a bit more diversity and a bit of its own uniqueness to the, to the game itself to have its own original shadows for us to use. So that's pretty much literally everything that I know of currently to do with Solar Leveling Rise, to do with literally everything with the game. And as pretty much, I think the only thing that we don't really know as of yet is if there's going to be a gacha system. And if there is a gacha system, what is it actually going to be? But we're going to have to wait and find out to see what that's going to be. But yeah, if you did enjoy this video or you found it helpful or useful, then don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.